Foundation, okay? this engineer Jess. For now, let's solve problem about uh, differential equations uh, in, uh, in linear equations. So, what are those linear equations? Then, what are those problems involving linear equations? Okay. So, this problem, uh, okay, again, linear equations are there are two forms if linear in x and linear in y. This time, uh, let's determine if this problem is uh, which form it uh, below. Okay. The problem is y dx over dy minus 2x is equal to 3y square minus 2. So this will be our problem. Okay. This is our solution. Okay, let's transform this prob uh, this problem linear in x or linear in y. But this time let's uh, try if uh, in dx over dy for linear in x for okay, to start let's copy the problem first if it's y it's dx over dy minus 2x is equals to 3 y square minus 2 and then to proceed Let's divide both sides by y. Okay, that's one. It's one over y. So this can be cancelled out. Okay, this is over y, and then here is one over y. Next is this one. It's, it's dx over dy. Okay, minus 2 uh, x over y is equal to this. that's 3 y square minus 2 over y okay. we have a clue if if uh, Bernoulli in x this is the general form the general form is this that is if dx over dy okay plus okay, p of y in terms of x and then this is in terms of q of y okay so therefore this will be now our Bernoulli oh no no our linear equations but this is uh, this is now our p of x no no it's p of y sorry and then this one this whole will be our uh, Q of Y. Okay. So solve for linear equations, we have a formula. Okay, let's do this formula. If it is in dx over dy, okay, let's try to remember this one. The, this is x, e, rest to we have P of Y dy is equal to integral of that is q of y okay. and then we have e integral of we have p of y dy and then that is dy plus c okay it's a very long formula but we can have a quick uh, And let's uh, do this in a uh, simpler form this one this will be our uh, the store common so we can uh, do this this is our integrating factor I am okay these two are our integrating factor to do that let's solve first the integrating factor okay that is e rest to vertical of v of y dy where our v of y is this one negative 2 over y and then that's dy okay then let's integrate that and it's a negative 2 okay. 
L and Y. The integral of one the y over y is the uh, L and Y. Then next is this one. This e uh, L and y press to negative 2 then this is cancel out this is equal to 1 okay so therefore our equation will be done our if will be y negative 2 or we can write this as 1 over y squared so therefore this our integrity factor is just 1 over uh, 1 over y squared then after that let's uh, and then let's input this uh, let's uh, our equations uh, the formula let's substitute okay. so to proceed this is x and then multiplied by the integrating factor i f is equals to or can we move this is equals to that is integral of that's Q of y okay, and then times integrating factor and then dy and plus c. Then after this one, we can now uh, directly uh, plug in this integrating factor. It's x, then 1 over y squared. This equals to this one. This will be okay. From our uh, equations, the, the value of our q of y. This is s. That's three y square minus two over y. Okay. That is three y square minus two over y, and then. Let's uh, plug in again this value of integrating factor that's 1 over y squared. Then that's dy plus c. And then next is uh, we need to retain this one it's x over y squared is plus this one. The integral of is 3y square minus 2. The denominator is this one, that's y over y square. That will be y cube. This parenthesis, and then that's dy. And then let's uh, extract the fraction. So, what will happen? This one, let's is let extract, extract this. That is three y square minus two over y cube. This will become that's three y square over y cube minus two over y cube. Okay. And then we can cancel this y y cube and then y is y square minus y cube the remaining is just uh, simply y and then this will become okay, that's, okay, that's 3 over y minus 2 over y cube so let's uh, plug in this uh, extracted fraction okay. Okay, let's continue this will become x over y square Plus two it's integral of okay, this one that's three over y minus 
2 over y cube dy plus plus c and then let's distribute this uh, integral sign to the quantity inside this that will become this x over y square this 3 test 3 integral of 1 over y dy minus 2 integral of okay that's y negative 3 because this denominator uh, it is the rest to the numerator the side convention will be negative then this one is dy plus this. next is uh, after that let's escape this left side x over y squared then the integral of 1 over y uh, dy this is just 3 ln y minus 2 okay the integral of uh, y rest to negative 3 dy that's why negative 3 plus 1 that's negative 2 all over that's negative 2 plus c and then did you notice that we can cancel out this one negative 2 so only a remaining is positive. The next is this is, is x over y squared plus to three L N Y plus a. Can we put this numerator to the denominator? This will become one over y no, it's one over y squared. And then plus c. Did you notice that we have common here y squared, the denominator? If we can uh, cancel it out, let's multiply both sides by y squared. Okay, so this can be canceled out. This can be canceled out. Then we have y squared here. And then we can have y squared here. So proceed this will be now our uh, uh, equation x is plus 2 that is 3 y squared ln y or we can write this uh, is 3 to the exponential of ln y or we can have we can transform this as ln y is ln that is uh, y square then ln y cube plus 1 plus c plus c y square so this is now our final answer to the solution of the, the differential equation and then this is our general solution Okay. Okay, let's have a quick review on this uh, our solution for linear differential equations. Okay, so actually it's uh, it's quite long solution. Okay. So this one, this is a problem. Uh, try to check if it is linear in x or it is linear in y so our problem met the condition to linear differential equations if it is dx over dy plus p of y x and then it's equals to q of y to this after extracting to the x over dy we can form that this is our p of y and then x okay we have x here and then more so this is our q of y okay. Okay. after it, it has met the condition 
we can use the formula of the linear in x. Okay? It is dx over dy, that is x, p, e, the integral of p of y dy, which equals to integral of p of y times e, uh, rest to integral of p of y dy, where this part is our integrating factor. To solve it more uh, or quite a low solution, let's isolate this first, the integrating factor if. This one is R. And then after we get the integrating factor, it's 1 over y squared. And then let's uh, plug in it to our equation or substitute. Okay, this is our. This is our formula, x times integrating factor is equal to q of y integral times integrating factor dy plus c. Then, after this uh, substitution, we can now have this one, integral of q of y, okay? our q of y is 3y squared uh, minus 2 over y plus the integrating factor is 1 over y squared dy plus c. Okay? And then to integrate this uh, easily, so let's extract this fraction. Okay, we can have this one. So the extract fraction this is 3 over y minus 2 over y cubed. Okay, after we integrate this, uh, no, we extract the fraction. Then let's do the integration. So it's look same here than this one, partial fraction. Then after that, uh, after, after integrating the equation, so let's uh, multiply both sides by y squared. So the denominator y squared will be eliminated. So this is now the uh, simplified answer: x is equal to y squared, and then y u plus one plus c y squared. This is now our general solution to the problem. Of linear differential equation. Okay, so I repeat that linear equation uh, has these two forms: if it's linear in x and if it's linear in y. Okay, this this formula I've uh, shown to you is formula for linear and uh, linear in x. So there's this formula for linear and y also. Okay, so hope you understand our solution for uh, this topic linear differential equation so thank you